which NFL teams are making the playoffs and who's staying home. It's who's in, who's out it's on 97.3 ESPN FM, South Jersey's football station. All right, we're going to run around and see uh, who's in, who's out. I'll tell you, after five weeks, this is very difficult. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, Seriously. there is no, like, clear cut except for, like, one division, two divisions. How often are you changing or who's in and who's out? By the week. It's almost yeah. weekly. It's just crazy how the NFL one week changes your mind on so many things. All right, AFC East Patriots. Pats. Pats. All right. We all agree. In the North, Bengals, Ravens, Browns, and Steelers, they're all in play. So, is anybody buying uh Cincinnati this week. I like the Bengals. I'm going Bengals. That Ravens defense is the only thing I can count on in this division. So I'll, I'm going I'll get, Bengals. I'm going Baltimore. I'm going Baltimore's defense. You know who sold me yesterday? Joiner. KC, yeah? He has the Bengals ranked in his power rankings number four. Oh, interesting. He's buying into them. I can never buy I'm not the saying most. I'm buying into them as a Super Bowl I team. I know, I know. Just going for the division. That Ravens team, I put them number four in my fine five, and they lost to the friggin' Browns. But the it, defense it did good. their job. They did. They, they did. did. The offense failed. You still, you lost it's to the First time the offense has really failed, too. This I'm true. Brown shaming you. I'm Cleveland Brown shaming okay, you. Okay, You Fair lost enough. to Cleveland. You, you deserve We're it. We're being shamed together. <laughs> yes. All right. It's okay. Group in the South, uh, wide open. I mean, Tennessee, Jacksonville, Houston, they're all in play. Listen, the Texans have won two straight, and we thought that they would be in a favorite, at least offensively, with the firepower they had. They boosted their defense. There's no reason that if Houston can get their offense under control, they can't win this division because Jacksonville's offense, you can't count on. The other two teams, I'm sorry, I don't care that Tennessee's 3-2. and two. I wouldn't put any harder money on them. As crazy as it sounds, I'll take Houston. I need to see Houston win one more game. They were my preseason pick for the division. But they made me feel really bad about that pick the first couple of weeks. I'm sticking with the See, Jags for the division. Talk about things changing. The first couple of weeks, you would say Houston stinks. Now you're putting them in the uh, conversation. I got Jacksonville, even though they got bombed. They got bombed. That wasn't weekend. good, man. That no. was not good. Uh, in the West, I got Kansas City. Mm. Last week, I actually made a, an argument for Denver, but that's out. Kansas City could go 16 and 0. I, I, I they could go 16 and 0. They do play the Rams coming up. No, I know, but the Rams could go 16 and 0 as well. Well, one of them can't. They no, play but, each but other. I'm saying like if there were to be one. <laughs> right, right, right. They're what playing. If, if, they're actually the playing Chiefs? that game in Mexico City. I'll take the Chiefs. <laughs> what if the Bengals beat the Chiefs? Anyway, um, that game got flexed. By the way, um, we'll have it for you on 97.3. I got Chiefs, just because there's nobody else. The Chargers got out of the month. Without an 0 4 record, that seems like a first. Yeah, they won two straight. Uh, give me your two wild cards. I got the Steelers and the Texans. Mm. Wow. No no Bengals, huh? No. I, I do not have any faith in Marvin Lewis to do anything right. Well, he's made the playoffs. Can't win the playoffs. I, this, isn't a, this isn't who's going to win in the playoffs. This is who's going to make the playoffs. The direct exercise here is who is in the playoffs, not who is going to win in the playoffs. I can just see Andy Dalton choking like November, December, like he always does. <laughs> He's been to the how many times has Dalton been to the playoffs? That guy's always in the playoffs. He just never wins. They can't win anything. Uh, since I have to go Cincinnati by default since I took Baltimore and I'll take Jacksonville. Jacksonville's good enough to make the playoffs. I've got Baltimore and Pittsburgh. Three teams in the north getting in. How about that? that that's tough. Pittsburgh, man, they no Bell. You know that's not happening. James Conner had a great game. Bell's coming back. Not here. <laughs> all right, that's our AFC look. Let's go to the NFC. Uh, Rams in the West. Rams. Give me LA. Yeah, no way. It's the Rams. South, I've got New Orleans. Uh, again, I'm going to give you the same reason why I took Baltimore in that division. And the one thing I can count on is Carolina's defense. That's the only thing I can count on. Saints are great at home, but I need to see. looked better last night. It did look better last night, but Washington doesn't overpower you on offense either. So I'll, I'll take Carolina, and I'll get to New Orleans winning it as far as the wild card. But Carolina. Uh, give me the Saints because the Panthers defense just gave up third to the Giants. That's true. At home. Good You're point. allowed an anomaly. You are. <laughs> uh, in the north. <laughs> this one's interesting. you got the Bears, Packers, Vikings now. The Lions beat the Packers. I mean, I don't know what to do with this division. We buy anybody buying the Bears? 
I think as long as Aaron Rodgers is healthy, you have to default to Green Bay. You just don't know if Mitch Trubisky can hold up for an entire season as far as being able to play. I, I reluctantly take Green Bay. I'm going to go way on a limb here and just say the Lions just because I have no... Wow. I'm, I just, for some the reason, Lions. that game just felt like a fait accompli. Like, you missed that many field goals. There's got to be some juju, mm. some some fairy dust, some some cult, something. I don't know what it is. There's there's something crazy going on in Detroit right now. Uh, I'm going with the Packers. I don't feel strong about it, but I'm going with the Packers because they got the best quarterback in that division. But that division's up for grabs. It definitely is very intriguing. Uh, in the East, anybody going off of Philly yet? No. No. But, I mean... Where would you go? Washington? Are you really going to put all your, your eggs in the Dak Prescott basket? I'm not. Every I'm not team either. in that division is a minus right now. Nobody's got a plus differential. The Eagles are a minus one. Washington's a minus four. The Cowboys are minus 13. And the Giants are minus 24. That division's embarrassing right now. You're right. And we did this the other day. The Eagles have the 25th offense. The Giants are 24th. And the Redskins are 23rd. I don't know what they are after last night. And Dallas is 30th. Right. The four, four of the ten worst offenses in the league all reside in the NFC East. <laughs> I got Philly. My wild cards, I'm going Carolina, and I'm going Bears. I'll take New Orleans and Chicago. I got the Packers and the Panthers. Give me Aaron Rodgers, and for some reason I feel like Cam will figure it out. Bears? Yep. 65 points they've given up. Although they've only played four games as opposed to five, like many teams out there. But I think their defense is uh, it's amazing. It's pretty that defense. good. Yeah. Will Max. Right, that's, that, that's a team you don't want to. If you're Philadelphia, you do not want to see that team in the playoffs. I don't care if it's here in Philadelphia. That defense will travel. That's Will Mack for MVP? That's who's out. Uh, that? He's got to be in Mack there. Will Mack for MVP? Uh, he's got to be up there so far. You're right.